Hey, jeez! Welcome back to my summertime rendering reactions. I'm recording this kind of late because I got really sick yesterday and I'm still sick right now. It actually never left. It's been two weeks. <laughs> actually, it left for like a few days and then it got worse again and then I, and it's a lot better now. I might need to snort and blow my nose every now and then. I'm sorry about that. <laughs> like that. <laughs> sorry about that. But uh, what happened last time? Last time we got a bit more flashbacks with Hizuru and Haine. We learned that they were friends until Haine ate Hizuru's brother. And then uh, Hizuru, uh, Hizuru, uh, Haine's like, I'm gonna let you go for now because we're friends, but I'm gonna kill you next time. So yeah. And then uh, we get a little little team up with everyone. And then uh, Shinpei is giving a little speech that sucked so badly, but it's very Shinpei, so I'm, I'm okay with it. So, and then Shinpei suddenly resets to the time that he was cooking. And he, we don't know why or how he died. So that's concerning. It could be a completely different thing that's happening, but uh, I don't know. It could be something completely different. So let's do this. It's gonna be two versions of this reaction video. A vision picture version, which you can find in the description below, and time beast version, which you're watching right now. If you want to sync up your own music to the time beast version, you can do that. I'm not saying out on some god of a hide. Because that's what they do. And zero is the same thing. My video just playing on my screen. Let me just fix some stuff like minimizing OBS, checking subtitles, checking audio track. This is the most seeded one, but for some reason I don't feel like this is the best subtitle file, but eh, we'll, we'll keep going with it. I honestly don't know what the best subtitle file for this would be because I just pirate them. <laughs> it's not easier for me to do that. I talked about that in the in the very first episode. Okay, so it's time I will go here. Sandwich. Ding, ding. I'm sweating so much. Yep, what's happening? Oh, the shot. Oh, wow. Oh, bullet, okay. Of course it's a bullet, I just said it got shot. Oh, they took control over of uh, Nezu. Yeah, they got Nezu. This she he died. Yeah, they got Nezu's rifle. We keep seeing this vision, I don't know why. No, they're just gonna keep killing him until he can't loop anymore. Mm hmm. Yep. Oh no. Oh, the edges. Is that what that's supposed to be? Yeah, that's what it's supposed to be. Ooh, that's bad. Okay, that's all I just have. Ah, that's all about. That, uh, I messed that up. Uh, I'm just gonna check my recording. If I'm just gonna be AP discussions, I'll be back over on YouTube. Sometimes Bitchut takes my videos and puts it on Bitchut for some reason, but I don't know why. I can't really do anything about it. I tried so many different things. But uh, yeah, please check out YouTube if you're watching the AP. Uh, thank you to the Patreon to get the views. If you're going to that, so leave a like on the video, subscribe to the channel. Whee! 10 episodes left after this. We don't have that many episodes left.
All hands loot. Okay, let's keep going. Seventh loot, July twenty second. Okay. Okay. Okay, that's an interesting way to put it. Mm hmm, that makes sense. Do you know where? Oh yeah, okay, that's what, that's the visuals. Okay, get it, I get it. Mm-hmm. Okay. Okay, that's what we're calling it. It's a black hole, I guess. Okay. I slept so much and I'm still sleepy. That's what medicine, that's what my insomnia meds do. What? Oh, that's... Okay, that's bad. Okay. Okay. That's pretty far. Relatively. That makes sense. Okay. That's good. Okay. Yeah. It's a sniper rifle, for God's sake. Right. There we go. Okay. We're getting it. Wow. Oh no, that's a lot. How are you gonna do this, Shinpei? <laughs> yeah, I, I'm kinda confused. <laughs> there we go. That's a uh, freaking Ushio. Yep. <laughs> Bridal carry us again. Oh, that facial expression, that's great. Okay, she makes pretty smart. He knows what he's doing. Oh. 
We are taking them down. Is that an umbrella? A parasol? Is it? I'm not sure. Oh my god. Need to go finish it off then, hunting. Okay, it is happening. Oh, do you know I just realized her voice kind of changes whenever she turns to Ryunosuke. Her voice is slightly lower. Nice! Go! Oh, that didn't hit. Oh! I just want acrobatic meal. Wait, what? I thought she... Wait, she can still control some shadows? She still has access to that? Oh, she's using shadows against shadows! That's cool. Woo, that's sick! Oh no, that's a gun. Oh, ooh, ooh, took that hit for Shinpei. Two seconds into the future, that's kinda sick. Okay. Oh, it's like a, a thing for like sewage. I thought it was a parasol for some reason. What is she this weakness? How do we kill this thing? <laughs> oh, that's also well animated. Well choreographed, not well animated. That's a problem. That's that's the reason why I thought she had no control over the shadows. And this isn't the highness supposed to be the one that in control of these shadows. Whoa, whoa, why? Ushio! Nice, okay. Oh, <laughs> facial expressions in the show. Especially in like the latter parts. That are relative to what I'm watching right now. Okay. Woo! We get some sick animation this episode. Oh, that's bad. Yeah. Nice. 
Me. Attack the shadow. The shadow shadow. Ooh, got hit. What? What do you expect? We're, we're on a disadvantage here, like a very big disadvantage. Oh, she's using her hair. What are those? Water? Water? Gasoline? Oh, it's gasoline! Hell yeah! Nice. Yeah, we kind of learned that at some point with the uh, underground stuff. That's creepy. <laughs> Go police guy! I forgot your name. That's hair. Let's go. What it's gonna turn into. Oh, it's a gun. Nice. This is intense. I love this episode. Please don't be affected by that, please don't be affected by that. Don't, don't, just kill it, kill it, kill it! Just kill it, kill it! Ah, you lost our opportunity! That's bad. That's really bad. And she's burning. At least we found this guy's weakness. <laughs> Oh, that's bad. Oh, no. Oh no. Is she dead? Ah, uh, the little shell. Uh, nice. How did that happen, but nice. I don't know how that happened, but sure. Keep it up. What did you grab on? Oh, nice! Good job, Ushio. Did we kill? Did we kill this guy? Shide, I think is his name. Oh. 
What? Uh, fire's gone. Why? How? The audio seems weird. Uh What? <laughs> oh wow, yawning so much. Well, uh, Shinpei, I think you're the one dying right now. Ushio's a shadow, so she's a lot more sturdy. Shide, I was right, okay. Treat Shinpei. She asked about mom and dad, though. Hmm. I'm gonna talk about that for a bit. Shim, Shimpei, you're bleeding. Shimpei, you're the one dying right now. Yeah, you shot. Oh, thank God! Ah, uh, good, good. Ah, uh, uh, no kiss. Sorry. Okay, hug. It's good. Yeah, it's gonna hurt. That's gonna hurt. <laughs> nice. Where's everyone else? Please tell me everyone else is safe. It's nine, almost 9 p.m., okay. Oh, okay. Yeah, there's a human body inside, we don't know who. Oh, the air! That's what she did. Yep, yeah. She scanned and copied the air. Wow. Mm-hmm. Oh, okay, that makes sense, I guess. Mm. Yeah, bros. Okay, sir. <laughs> Why do I keep going there? <laughs> Who is it? Oh, okay. Oh, that's cool. Okay, that's all for this episode. I think. Yeah, okay. Uh, very cool episode. Had a lot of really interesting um, choreography to it. Like, the fight choreography is surprisingly good for what this show is. Like, I expected this show to have more, you know, like a mystery element to it because it is a mystery show, like a thriller. But the thing is, 
uh, whenever there's fights, it's usually like, I'm gonna smack this shadow once and it's gonna die, or this shadow will run and it's gonna run away, and it's like, yeah, it's, um, <laughs> it's not as complex as, uh, the other fights. The other fights are not as complex as the ones that are in this episode, so I'm just really surprised by that. Anyways, I need to go pee and blow my nose. I'll be right back. Alright, I'm back. Let's go through this episode chronologically. Um, let's go here. So, Shinpei's back when he was making sandwiches and of course Ushio realizes that they're, they looped again so they so they were like, okay, what happened? And Mia's with them, it's great. Uh, and then we learned that Shinpei got shot by a rifle, by a sniper rifle. Nezu's sniper rifle. So the reason why they killed Nezu was so that they could copy Nezu, take his real gun that apparently because it, 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 if you were to take a copy of the gun, it needs to be it would be useless because of the range of the copied gun. So we need to take the actual gun and then shoot Shinpei. So yeah, so realizing that it's a bad idea to put Nezu really far away. And I like this. Uh, finally realizing what this means. The edges of time. It's a really cool visual that they're using. Uh, the way they explained how uh, how his time time stuff works is really cool as well. Um, the the vision the visuals of you know the the crumbling the crumbling path behind him as he's walking forward and how he's teleporting back and then if he teleports back far enough he's he, he would just fall into the abyss or whatever we just fall out so yeah that's really cool I like that I was wondering what that meant with the <laughs> with the with the opening because I, I thought the visual was really cool not as cool as the I'm gonna shoot myself in the head I don't know which one is cooler. <laughs> Like, th that's how the openings end, so yeah. This little e explanation, really cool. I like that. Um, yeah, let's talk about the fights, okay. Uh, so it's going to be the last loop after I die, okay. Okay, we learned that uh, the copies of like a 50 meter range radius of, um, of, air of effect, so if you're using a sniper rifle, this, what I said earlier, that's why it's useless. It's like a sniper rifle should be some, from somewhere really far away, right? So it's gonna be useless if the bullets just disappears after 50 meters. It's still pretty, 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 a pretty big area, relatively speaking. Like you can still do a lot of damage with a lot of different things by doing that. I want to say, did Shinpei plan this? If so, he is really smart. Like, uh, like, smart, tactically smart. I think, like, uh, I think he's really good at this. Like, um, he probably died so many times that he decided decide to do this already. Because he acts kind of different from how he acts with, uh, when they were underground. Where he was just like, I'm ready to die. Because right now he realized that he can't really die that many times anymore. So, yeah. He has this weird complex with uh, saving people. Not saving people, more like help, helping people. So yeah. Okay, and Ushio's there. And you're just shooting down all the randos. Understood mother, okay. Uh, 10.30. Freaking soul, just being useless. Totally called summoning shadows is really cool. Like, this is a really good asset to have. Shadows against shadows, because we know that will work really well. And we learned later that it was Ushio that uh, severed the bond between these shadows and freaking Haine. Okay, that's really cool. Um, okay. There's something here that I want to look at. Where is it? I think it's this part. Yeah, this part. Yeah, learn once, of course we are. Just shooting while jumping backwards, that's really cool. Oh boy! Ryunosuke is awesome. And then flip. <laughs> that was a very unnecessary flip, but I, I love it. <laughs> and then shoot again. Woo! I think the shots don't actually line up with where they, their heads explode. That's kind of an awkward bit of, uh, I don't know, animation. Um, again here. They, they're actually, no, it's, it's not that bad. It's just slightly off, but it's not that bad. It's, re it's really just, you're watching this like happen like in real time, like really quickly. So you don't really notice it. So it's okay if they do that. I think we're done here. 
Yeah, we're done here. Mizuru, this is, I forgot her name. She says it later, but still. I saw the shot hitting. Huh, interesting. Okay, so we learned that Haine can see through two seconds ahead of time. Like, can you, can you actually change that? Hmm. I wonder how that actually works. There's a lot of time stuff in the show that I didn't expect. Um, apparently, Haine is like some kind of goddess of time, so maybe. I thought she was a goddess of fishing and fortune. <laughs> but apparently, she controls a lot of things about time as well. Two seconds ahead. I wonder how that works. There's a character that in anime or in any kind of fiction that does a similar thing. A lot of this is a weird comparison to make, but this is the first thought that came to my mind when I asked that question. You know, Night Eye? <laughs> and <laughs> what's interesting about Night Eye is that we don't know whether or not you can change the future. Like, I get the feeling he, she can change the future. Like, she can see. See, oh, it's completely different now that I think about it. Yeah, it's completely different. Never mind, never mind. It's completely different. It's slightly different. Not completely. But still. Uh. Okay, so Ushio somehow did this and they realized that we can do the same thing for Mio Shadow. That's interesting. Uh, Tomiko being on our side is really cool. <laughs> because she's an interesting character. Um, I don't really see that much of her. I haven't really seen that much of her yet, but she's interesting. So yeah. I'm itchy. Oh wow, that's a rash. That's gross. Um, <laughs> and she just smiles. So is that the reason why they're not necessarily killing Mio's shadow immediately because they're planning on actually turning it into an ally? That's interesting. Um, your body's so graceful. <laughs> because didn't is it one of her uh conditions for helping Haine to keep Mio safe? Does she like Mio? <laughs> I would love that if she likes me like the the siblings like the same girl. That's great. I would love that. <clears throat> also she's gonna be gay as all hell and I I'm all for it. <laughs> or maybe she just admires Mio. I don't know why I immediately ship them. To be perfectly honest, I more so ship this uh Toiko Mio compared to So Mio. I don't know why. <laughs> I want, I want to say that it's because of the age, but isn't Tawiko's older? Never mind, Tawiko's older, so it's not that. <laughs> I don't know why, it's, it's cuter in my in my head. Okay, gasoline! But there's something you want to look at first. At uh, 12... Zero, zero. This part. This part is really cool. Not bad. Where is it? 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 There's something here that's really cool. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Can't find it. Oh, that's why. Because I'm too far off. <laughs> I'm too far away. This part. This part is really cool. Let me go back a bit. This part. This part, this part is well choreographed. Yeah, it's not, it's not well animated, just well choreographed. I like it. Whee! That's <laughs> so fun. Okay. Nothing too crazy, but I like it. Again, because I did not expect something like this in this kind of show. So that is very much welcome. Okay, let's keep going. Um. <clears throat> So hey, let's see, look at this facial expression, it's so good, so well drawn. It's going to be very fun. Okay. Everybody's so peaceful, it's a shame. So much for fair and square, huh? And gasoline and then burn! So we learn weakness of shadows, another weakness of shadows is fire. And it's probably the only thing that Shide can die from because we actually tried to attack his shadow but uh, it doesn't really affect him, or it. It doesn't really affect it. So, yeah. 
I, I'm, I'm okay calling Heine a her because of how much character growth that she had, like uh, character development that she had. But um, I'm not so sure about uh, Shide. <laughs> because Shide just seems like an underling, not an underling even, like a tool, more so. So yeah, I'm not so sure about that. This is also Ushio. I freaking love that we should keep showing the hair, and that the hair keeps transforming to things. I wonder how true this is. I wonder how true this is. Because, excuse me, she says that she wants to live with, it, with her mother and father, right? And when, uh, in the first time that uh, Hizuru went and attacked their home, when they died, she started crying. Like, there was no need for crocodile tears at that point. Like, she. There, there was no need for her to manipulate anyone at that point that she needed to actually cry fake tears. So I was wondering whether or not there's some semblance of truth to what she's saying in this moment. But other than that, I still agree that Oshiro well, should have just killed her immediately. <laughs> like, seriously. Not again, Oshiro was getting manipulated by her. It's what she does, so yeah. And I got caught. I was so I was so devastated when uh, uh Shinpei is dying while freaking Ushio is burning to death. Also, I want to talk about this a bit, just a bit. Um, the way Shide starts stuttering is so creepy. <laughs> that creeped me out so much. Like you know how there's like videos, like creepy videos on YouTube where it's literally just like a uh, broken speech and it, and then some some weird images to it. That's what it feels like. It feels like one of those creepy pasta videos where it's like, like uh, 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 they stutter a lot and then it just the, the 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 voices glitch. That's what it felt like to me. And I used to love those kinds of stuff when I was uh, like in my earlier teens. So excuse me, I used to love that kind of stuff when I was in my earlier teens. So that's what it reminded me of immediately, and I was creeped out because of that. So yeah, that's really fun. Um, and then, she, and then, yep, and then she goes back, and we learn that she, uh, by Shemin Haine, or she, she would, uh, freaking copy the air <laughs> to create a vacuum. Wow. It's, this part I want to talk about as well. I'm hungry. That's interesting. Uh, did I talk about this before? I don't know if I did or not. But is it possible that. Heine just wants to live, like, like the, the whole question of is the fox wrong for eating a hare, like the the whole thing of he, they're just hungry and they need something to eat and the only thing that they can eat are humans. So what do they do? They eat humans. I'm wondering about that right now because Heine actually seems like a child, like. Oh, you know what this could connect to? Maybe she found Shiori, I think that's this person's name. And then um, learned that she had like a loving family and then immediately was like, I want a loving family too. And then that's why she decided to, to use Shiori's body. That's, that's interesting. Hmm. Hmm. I don't know. Interesting. Ah, okay. Okay, copy too much. Yeah, but for best. I wonder what he used for this. That's, that's such a good idea though. Like, the enemy is now thinking that at some point they weren't gonna loop because Shinpei is dying and then they just don't loop. Okay, um, yeah. Charles are cyber hit too. At least they're not vital. Also, Ushio just showed me hugging him. It's great. Oh, You know what's sad about that? They're not gonna end up together because Ushio is a shadow. Probably never gonna end up together because of that. Yeah. I don't know if it's gonna happen, but I get the feeling that because the mother of all shadows is Haine, like what happens when we defeat Haine? Will Ushio just disappear? Yeah? Or will Ushio just stay here? Can can we actually- Can, can Shinpei date Ushio as shadow? <laughs> That's what I wanna know. I ship it. <laughs> Izuru just going through the thing, recording everything. We're all alive, that's what matters the most. Yay! 
Yay! Okay, what else do I want to talk about? Let me check my notes after this. Okay, so we're gonna turn you into an ally. Huh, interesting. We learned a lot about Highness abilities right now. Like, she's a lot more powerful <laughs> than I thought she would be. Like, um, yeah. That's really interesting. Uh, I wonder how we're gonna beat her. Um, we survived this, especially Shinpei survived this, especially Usha survived this, our most important characters right now. And also, he's really, really important because we need her knowledge and the like, fighting expertise as Ryanosuke. I noticed earlier that when she switches to Ryanosuke, that her voice suddenly goes a tiny bit lower. The pitch is a tiny bit lower, so I noticed that. Um, anything else? Um, this is a cool episode. I don't know. I don't know, probably my favorite so far. Like so far, every single episode is becoming my favorite so far. I guess that's what's happening. That's what's happening. This show really uh, kicks off at some point and now I love every second of it. <laughs> uh, I wonder what's gonna happen next. Um, because they were like, we're gonna finish this tonight. Um, yeah, that, that didn't happen. So <laughs> I wonder what we're gonna do next. Also, um, <laughs> excuse me. Also, uh, we're gonna get Mio Shadow as an ally. I wonder what that means, what in that entails exactly. I also wonder if it's gonna be similar to how Ushio and Ushio Shadow talked and just had their kind of a relationship. Like, how is that gonna work? I don't know. Hmm. Interesting. Um, I think I'm done. I think I'm done. Let me let me check my notes again. Let's see, wait. Okay, I think I'm done. So, that is it for me for now. If you want to see the next episode, if you want to discuss with Ronnie and everyone else, you can do that in case you want to know. If you can help out, you don't have to do it again. That means you're welcome to me, but I'm not a lot. That's what we'd like to do this. Subscribe to the channel, all the fun stuff, and bye!